thank you for joining us in the next episode of the Virtual Update. In today's video, we're going to be covering camera alignment. And now we need to figure out the camera alignment between our physical camera and our virtual camera. So if they're not aligned, we're going to get some items and some objects in our virtual world that seem like they're skating in the background. Now I can demonstrate what this looks like. I've set up a scene in Unreal and we have two poles in our scene. And now in physical space, we've also set up a camera with two poles at the exact same distances. If we move the real world camera, the poles do not stay aligned. But on the virtual ones, they still are overlapping. So to solve this issue, we need to offset the virtual camera to match the offset of the physical camera. To find the alignment, we need to know the distance from our tracker, and it's taken from the center of the back of our tracker to the pupil point of our camera. To find the pupil point of our camera, we have set up a simple card. And what this card shows is a series of lines that fan out from a single point at the back of the card. We've cut this section out so we can slot it over the lens of our camera. And when these lines, when these fanned out lines become straight, from the camera's point of view, we now know the depth of where our pupil point is in our camera. Now that we know the pupil point's location, we need to measure the distance between where the center of the back of our tracker is to the depth of our camera, where the pupil is. Now we have one direction of offset. We also need to locate the height offset of where our tracker is to that pupil. So wherever the tracker is located on the camera, we need to measure down to the center of our lens. So now that we have our offset information of our X and Z axis, we can come into Unreal. We come into the Live Link tab. We click on the tracker that is currently on our camera. And right underneath where we did our orientation offset, we need to do our position offset. So we know that our negative, our X is in a negative 12.5 and that our Z axis is a negative 16.5. Now you will see that the camera position moved while I was putting in this information. So now that we have both our offsets in Unreal, if we move our physical camera while being tracked, the offset between these two poles should align perfectly. And what this means is when we are filming with the virtual background, we won't have any skating of different elements in our scene. Well, thank you for watching this video and we'll see you in the next update.